the Giza pyramids, the greatest and the most durable antiquities in the world. They were built of huge stones that no force could move. When Khufu built his pyramid in 2580 BC, he considered it the only way that would give him immortality. What makes the Giza Plateau more mysterious is the half-human, half-beast statue of the biggest icon and puzzle on Earth. The Sphinx. In 2610 BC, an Egyptian man achieved the building of a pyramid. This is the Step Pyramid, the first stone building in history. It was built by the ingenious engineer Imhotep. It was for the resurrection of King Zosa. In one of the buildings, known as the House of the North, a memorial text was discovered. It was written by a scribe called Emos ibn Betha. I wrote, I came to this place in order to see the temple of King Zosa, and it seems like heaven dwells in it, and the god Ra shines from it. The journey of death was surrounded by danger, which was why the ancient Egyptians compiled spells that guaranteed safe passage to the afterlife. Inscriptions found in the Pyramid of King Titi in Saqqara are strong proof of the Pharaoh's search for immortal life. Close to Titi's pyramid is the most famous tomb of the pharaohs. It was made for the burial of the minister Mure Roka, the richest man in his time. The walls of these rooms are painted with views from his daily life. He died, but his spirit would return to his mummy in order to swim forever in the river of the other life. Ten thousand years after the sunset of the Pharaoh's era, a building centered in Cairo was constructed to be a vault for the Pharaoh's treasures. It is the Egyptian museum containing the greatest antiquities in human history. To 
Tutankhamun's treasure is the most famous hall in the museum. He was the youngest king from the richest family that ruled Egypt. His treasures are just a small indication of Egypt in its golden age. The Assembly of Religions The Hanging Church is considered the most famous church in Cairo. It is dedicated to the Virgin Mary. The Temple of Bin Ezra, also known as the Jewish Temple. This temple is where al Geniza was found in 1896. al is a number of documents containing information about the history and the political, economic and social life of the Jews under Arab rule. Amr ibn Ilas Mosque is the first one in Cairo and the fourth in Islam. It was built by Amr ibn al-As, the famous Islamic leader who fulfilled the Arab conquest of Egypt in 642 AD. Salah al-Din was one of the most famous Islamic leaders. He built this military fortress 540 years after the construction of the Amr ibn Elas Mosque. He called it the Mountain Castle. In the northern part of the citadel is the Mosque of Muhammad Ali. It was constructed in a unique position to be seen from all parts of Cairo. It was built in 1830 during the Ottoman rule. Islamic Cairo is an exciting place. El Hussein Mosque, one of the most famous mosques in the world, contains the grave of the grandson of Prophet Muhammad. Throughout the centuries, Egypt has changed. But one thing has never changed. The River Nile. The blood of life in Egypt. It flows from the heart of Africa and heads north for about 4,000 miles before arriving at the Nile Valley in Egypt. Without it, Egypt would be a desert. 